All right, Reagan family. So I am back again with another property tour. This is Dree's Custom Homes. And we've showcased this particular builder on this channel a couple times, but this one is absolutely gorgeous. Now, keep in mind, folks, this is a model house tour. I've gotten some comments that want to know what's upgrades, what's not. So if you don't mind, if you have any questions, you can reach out to the uh, phone number or the contact information below will get you taken care of. But as soon as you walk in, you have this beautiful double door. And let's go inside to the front foyer. And then as soon as you walk in, you are going to be greeted with the beautiful chandelier coming down. You have the beautiful staircase right there as well. Right to the right has this nice high ceilings. You have the wood flooring throughout as well absolutely gorgeous now what we'll do is we'll start to the first bedroom so we have that first bedroom right here to the left and you're going to have the beautiful candlelight chandelier right there you're going to have carpet inside of this bedroom right here and just depending if you are to build this particular plan or something very similar if you don't like carpet inside of the bedrooms, we can see about making other accommodations for you. But if you even notice the amount of space inside of the bedroom, you definitely sad of it. Oh, wow. Okay, so we're greeted with some Christmas decorations, but just gives you a base of how much space is in that particular closet. And then look how gorgeous the shower is here. So you got a built-in shower niche right here. You have the brass trim as well, brass shower head with the tile backsplash. I got a comment that said it's called shower surround. So whatever you call it, you know what I'm talking about. Then you have the brass lighting fixture. And if you even notice, you even have this gold trim around the mirror. All right, and you got tile flooring inside of here. And so what we'll do is we'll see this closet right here. I'll make sure to showcase the entire property, but you have a nice little closet right here as well. And what we'll do is let's go through this way. So that way you can see the mud room. So this will essentially be what you're greeted with. You have your mud room intertwined with the utility room you have the oversized washer and dryer so that just gives you a basis of how much space you have right there you have your sink right here and look at this little space right here how funny is that perfect for maybe some uh, small storage or what have you um, so essentially this would be the garage and you would walk in here grid it to the utility room and the mud room and then before we get to the kitchen You'll see you have this walk-in pantry. And even right here, you have a nice little storage space. A lot of times you might just put cases of water and things like that. And then you have your coffee bar right here. You got the built-in microwave with the built-in double stainless steel oven as well. You have the beautiful white cabinetry all along right there. And look how gorgeous this is. So as soon as you walk into the kitchen, you're greeted with the beautiful cabinetry. You have the stack cabinets on top as well with the glass pane that lets you see through. You have your beautiful quartz countertops right here. The green backsplash all along throughout there as well. You got your five burner built in stainless steel stove, farmhouse sink with the brass sink faucet right here as well. And look, you even got soft closing cabinets. And I always recommend that you get soft closing cabinets just because of the elegance, but more importantly, it doesn't slam shut. And there's a lot of ways you can go to a Home Depot and just get the um, the hinges. So that way you can have sat soft uh, uh, closing drawers. But look how gorgeous this is. So you have the high ceilings on top is that cathedral like ceilings that we always love. You have the exposed wooden beam as well with plenty of windows for natural light inside of here. 
you got the sliding door as well right there and I'll, I'll pan right here so you can see the fireplace so you have that tile on the fireplace it's an electric fireplace you have plenty of space you got that open concept that we so much love and so if you're coming through the front double doors you would walk through the foyer and this is what you would be greeted with absolutely gorgeous you got your wooden range hood you got your waterfall countertops right here waterfall island fantastic all right and so this will be your powder bath and Dree's custom homes i mean they are extremely unique with a lot of features that they add to the um you know to the property itself which is fantastic because they're almost in line with Toll Brothers. I would say Toll Brothers and Dries Custom Homes, they definitely add a lot of nice, elegant touches. So this will be the second bedroom right here. So essentially, this would be something like a flex room just because you don't have that, uh, that closet in here or the window, but you could add that if you needed to, okay? And this will be your primary. Before we go to the primary bedroom, let's see the primary bath. Absolutely fantastic. So you have the quartz countertops, you have the gold trim handles, gold trim faucet, and then you also have that gold trim on the mirror frame again. So we keep it, they're keeping it uniform throughout the property. You don't see a lot of mix max, uh, mix matched upgrades, but look at this nice soaking tub. You have more brass trimmer on there. Wow. Dual sinks right here. You have that LED underneath the cabinetry. Fantastic. And look how large this shower is. You have the glass all around. You got your shower niche again, the shower bench, towel flooring. Wow. So in here, I would definitely recommend to add a waterfall shower head. I think that would just complete it. But if you don't need that, you're definitely okay. Got your toilet right there to the right. And then you have your nice size closet with the built-in drawers, built-in shelving, plenty of space. It's not the biggest um, closet that we've seen, but it definitely gets the job done in my opinion. Of course, you can let me know in the comments below what you folks think. All right. Without further ado, before we get there, look at this. A nice little section, almost like a hotel. And this is the primary bedroom. Beautiful tray ceilings with the exposed wooden beam again. You got the brass candle-like chandelier in here. And look how much space you have. The wood flooring continues in this one. You notice we had the carpet in the first bedroom, but I definitely love the wood flooring extending inside of some of these bedrooms. Fantastic. And of course, if this is your first time to the channel, my name is Marcus Rankin. I am a Texas realtor. I get calls, texts, and emails every single day from folks looking to make a move out here. So if you are in that bucket now or in the future, don't hesitate to reach out. And if you're a returning viewer, welcome back. Always glad to have you. And consider hitting that subscribe button. I'd love to have you a part of the ranking family. And that way you're one of the first to be notified when I drop another video. Okay. So over here, you have your nice little dining room. So that way you're taken care of. If you notice, look how beautiful even the chandelier coming down is. Like I said, you got plenty of windows in here. Perfect for Thanksgiving dinner. You'll definitely be taken care of. All right, all right, so let's take a look upstairs. So you got this nice, beautiful flooring going upstairs and then you have the wood flooring up here as well. This is immediately what you're greeted with. Absolutely fantastic. Imagine just having all the family to entertain right here. Beautiful chandelier coming down again. Plus you have these three windows oversized nice windows adding a lot of natural light inside of here 
Wow, fantastic. And look how beautiful the media room is. So you got recessed lighting on the top. You have plenty of space in here. Sometimes I'll see the media room and you know, it's a little bit small, almost half the size of here. So you have plenty of space to add all those theater seats or look how large this couch is right here. You have that nice cozy carpet inside of here as well. Fantastic. All right, so let's go see the other bedrooms. And this will be the next bedroom. LED ceiling fans again in here. Definitely have plenty of space for the upstairs bedroom. They did have carpet in here, but really to each his own. Look how much walkway you have. You have plenty of space. Definitely great size. They didn't skimp on the size of the bedroom and even the walk-in closet. They have plenty of space in here. Let's go right across the hall and I'll make sure to open every single door. That way you can see what's going on. Then you have the brass lighting fixture right there, gold trim on the mirror framing as well. You have granite countertops with the white cabinetry. Let's see, and it puts off closing cabinets in here, but it's okay. Brass shower head again, shower tub combo, unique tile, shower surround or backsplash, whatever you want to call it. And we got a nice little closet right here. And this will be the final bedroom. This will be the closet as soon as you're greeted right to the left. And this will be your attic, a storage space in there. This one comes equipped with the bathroom as well. So this one has the black trim on the mirror, uh, as far as the mirror framing and the cabinetry, different cabinetry. So let me know in the comments what you folks think about it, but you do have the granite countertops in here again. And this one, instead of the shower tub combo, you have the standing shower. You got your brass shower head again. Got your little shower deal right there. So really just depends. I mean, some folks love taking a shower. Some folks love taking a bath. Some, you know, depending on the day, they'll do both. So really just depends on what you want. And look how much room you have in here as well. Wow. So I'd say, based on my experience, Dree's Custom Home, they definitely did a fantastic job as far as this one. So this one does have about, approximately about $300,000 in upgrades inside of here. But base, you would be starting in the 600s and just depending on what you need, you can get it accommodated. And let's take a, a look at the backyard covered patio. And this is an oversized covered patio. If you notice, the cathedral light ceilings extends in here. And you got your ceiling fan right there. You got the built-in grill over here. You got your granite countertops again. And this would be looking at the back of the property, the exterior. Got that painted brick. And I definitely love the sliding glass doors. I think it just adds a perfect little touch, in my opinion. And then this will be the back of the property. So that, folks, is Dree's Custom Homes. All right, Ranky family. So that was Dree's Custom Homes. Did it meet your expectations? Let me know in the comments what you folks thought about it. Me personally, Toll Brothers and Dree's Custom Homes, you really can't go wrong with them. Of course, if you do want more information, link in the description below, and I'll see you folks on the next property tour.